when we when we really like nailed it when we went to go shoot his podcast uh -huh. it was so easy like Right, most right. of the times before when we did a podcast before it was like what am i going to talk about what are the questions i'm going to say how am i going to do this but because we've already figured out what his passion is and, and what he wants to talk about then when right. he brings people onto his podcast that becomes the through line you know i have another attorney in fort lauderdale who is a cancer survivor and she like blew it off as if it was nothing who wants to hear about my 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 my, my uh getting over cancer and I was like, wait, hold on, what? Let's right. talk about that. Let's unpack that for a second, right? What's What was the story behind it? Well, I had just had my kid, things were going wrong. I was asking my doctors, they they were right. putting it off as if, um, as if it was just hormone imbalance and that I just had a kid. And she's like, so she self-diagnosed herself on online, found out that there was this rare cancer. And right. ended up in New York and, and eradicated the cancer, but she wouldn't be here right now had she not trusted her instincts. And so I said, well, let's talk about that. Let's talk about, you know, those moments, those fork in the road moments in your life that that made you who you are. Right. And those are the things that you start to figure out about yourself when when you have those epiphanies when you have those moments that that rock you and that change you forever and then those how you overcome the obstacles become the thing that makes you who you are you can't grow if you're patting yourself on the back i always say that right but when you're growing from something when there's obstacles that's when that's when you really truly become the person you're supposed to become right yeah. and yeah. then there's there is people are always looking for that perspective to like help them go through you mm -hmm. know to help them get over what they're going through and i told her i said if you help one person overcome cancer because they didn't just rely on their doctor and they did some research and they got a second third opinion and they were able to survive as a as as a result of listening to your story don't you think that's a life worth living right right she was like, yeah and i was like and don't you see how in, 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 in a roundabout way, don't you see how it will further grow your company because you're living your authentic self and you're living your truth, right? We're not creating content in order to grow the business. The, the business will grow as a result of us living authentically and us continuing to help in the ways that are authentic to us. That's what I mean by living your authentic self.